I'm Mark Garnison. I'm out here with my family. We've got Madeline has a fish on. Yeah. Fishing with Madeline, Micah, Molly, my wife Monique, and my good friend Roger Cormier. We're out downrigging here. Beautiful first fish to start the day. Oh, there you go, Marco. Nice that walleye. Keeper? Yeah, that's a keeper. Good job, Maddie. Well, today Mark and I switched roles a little bit. He gets a chance to fish with his family, and I get to drive the boat around. And typically in August here on Minnesota's Lake of the Woods, you're going to have a really good trolling bite. So we're on one of the Arneson's charter boats. Plenty of room for a family or a big group. You know, it's a great way to go fishing up here, catch lots of walleyes, all different sizes. Definitely some fish to eat, as well as some bigger ones to let go. We'll talk more about some of the lures that we're using here in a minute, but good start. We're on some fish. We're up on Lake of the Woods out here, just in the basin. We're pulling shad wraps and some scatter wraps out here for walleyes and saugers. Up on Lake of the Woods in the summer, we have a six fish limit for walleyes and sauger. No more than four can be walleye. Slot being anything between 19 and a half and 28 have to be immediately released and you're allowed one trophy over 28. So we'll put that in for the cooler and have some fish tonight. Typically in late summer, we're trolling a lot of crankbaits in the main basin of the lake. The fish are scattered out throughout the basin, so you cover more ground. And number seven size lures work real well. We're pulling mostly shad wraps and scatter wraps today. That imitates the size that the forge has grown to by late summer here in the lake. UV patterns, brighter patterns like fire tiger and some of the whites work typically pretty well, imitating the shiners in the lake as well as the perch. Earlier in the summer, if you come up here, you can catch walleyes a lot of other ways. Dropping bobbers on the shallow reefs or along the shorelines works real well, as does either jigging or pulling three-way rigs with spinner crawler harnesses. It's a very dynamic fishery here on Lake of the Woods. A lot of your classes are well represented. You're always gonna get your big ones. You're also gonna be able to catch some eaters to bring home. And with the liberal limits, it's a great place to come if you wanna keep some fish to bring home from your vacation. Another nice eye. Bring it up in the middle there. Perfect. It's really nice taking the kids out on these charter boats. They got a lot of room out here on the boats. You're not cramped or anything. There's lots of fish, lots of action for them, and let's get them out and have them enjoy the outdoors. Number seven shad wraps, you can see this blue and white one in the boat's just been chewed up over time. But think about a shad wrap, it's, it's a real steady wobble like that. Triggers a lot of fish up here, but we're also catching quite a few fish on the scatter wrap shad deep. This color has been real hot and also the perch. And the thing about a scatter wrap, you, you troll it steady or retrieve it steady like that, but because of that patented scatter lip, every so often it kicks out to the side like that. And that real erratic dart kind of imitates a bait fish that's fleeing a predator, triggers a lot of strikes. So same profile bait, different action based on the scatter lip on the new baits. Easy bud, it's steady pulls, okay? Fighting pretty good, huh? Any big? Does this mean I can eat all your Skittles while you're fighting that fish? I don't have any more. He has them all in his Figures. Good job. Oh no, he's on the edge of the net. Nice one, Micah. Always good for the kids. There we go, we just about got our limit of walleyes. A few bonus saugers mixed in and be a fish fry tonight. Charter fishing on Lake of the Woods is a great option for a group of couples, a larger family, a group of guys that want to fish together. Lake of the Woods is always going to give you lots of bites, great action for the kids, and of course you can bring lots of fish home from your trip. If you want to bring your own boat, Arneson's Rocky Point Resort has a full service marina, concrete boat launch, Full services, gas, ice, bait, everything you need for your own boat. You can stay in the housekeeping cabins on the south shore of Lake of the Woods. Fully stocked kitchens there. You just bring your own groceries and beverages to take care of your own meals. Or you can eat in the Rock Harbor Lodge. Great place for some dining there. If you're interested in lakeshore ownership up here in Lake of the Woods, Flag Island Properties, Arneson's Rocky Point Resort, is something you want to check out. They have a remote cabin that you can rent up there. Or if you're interested in owning a piece of this paradise, you should go to arnesons.com for more information on those real estate opportunities. Well, the 
thing about coming up to Minnesota's Lake of the Woods is we can always get plenty of fish to eat, huh, Mark? Yeah, we had a great half day out here with the kids and with you guys, and I mean, we've got some beautiful walleyes and some bonus saugers. We're gonna have a great fish fry tonight. If folks want to come up here with their family and friends and experience Arneson's Rocky Point Resort, how do they reach you? Oh, they can give us a call at 1-800-535-7585 or look us up on the web at arnesons.com. Your kids have fun fishing today? Yeah. I'm Roger Cormier, folks. We'll be right back with more Midwest Outdoors.